concept of the show is that people win for making choices. You have to live with that choice that you've made. That's a choice you're going to have to live with for the rest of your life. It's not whether or not you win or lose. It's seeing yourself on the silver screen. They just want to see themselves on that see, little... No, I think I don't agree with that. No, that's great. luck. It's all luck. It's all pure luck. A little wired. Last thing, one, two, one, two. <laughs> Hold on over here. Jim, we're going to do it again. Are you okay? Oh, poor Jim. <laughs> we're going to do it again. Three. Charles says number three. Nobody chose door number one, so let's go ahead. Where you going, Bill? Come back here. You're going for your door. No, just hang tight right here, okay? Now, you can talk it over, but the final decision's up to Al. What do you think, huh? You gonna go for the car? Don't, don't hit me if I say I don't. <laughs> you can keep the 50 bucks or use it to buy what's behind curtain number two over there. What are you gonna do? The uh, pirate said buy it. I'll buy it, buy it, buy it, buy it, buy it, buy it. Okay. <laughs> You're Santa Claus. You're the guy giving out the gifts. Or the Say. Easter Bunny. It's kind of fun, adventurous to have that little edge in daily living. Lord, and that is Bruce. He's going to help you guys out. He'll let you know when to applaud and crap, uh, clap, scream. <laughs> <laughs> He'll help you out the best he can. Oh, it's our leaning tower of pizza. <laughs> Oh, Cheryl, get away from that thing. It doesn't look too sterile. Close the... St st stable. I mean... <laughs> Close the doors, guys. <laughs> I, I know for yeah, a fact you that Eric a, got hit once. You have it pretty easy, though. I mean, with me being the comic relief of the show, I have to come running downstairs. What you say? I, I don't think I don't think you make mistakes, Bob. Bob's perfect. Wait, thank you. I think you are perfect, aren't you? Can I pretty much pattern my acting skills <laughs> after Bob? Don't you know, forget that the camera also <clears throat> adds weight. I'm actually only about what 110, 120 pounds, but the camera lens I... adds things. We're gonna take the money. <laughs> We're gonna keep. Now you guys have some money there, and I want to offer. Ouch! I want to offer you a deal. Here's Rick. Give him a nice hand. Come on over here, Rick. Bob. Bob. Rick. Well, then you better give her fifty bucks too. Yeah. All right. Let's get let's get our our Roman girl in the front row. Roman. Yes. It's you. 
come right up here. Let's give her a nice hand. She's stuck to the chair with the clothes. <laughs> She's caught. <laughs> That's all right. We'll do the deal down here. <laughs> there, she's free. This is Shirley. There we go. Shirley, why don't you step right over there? No, no, you got to get close. I know he's scaring you away, but don't let him scare you. Be kind to Shirley, Bob. There we go. Now, Bob, since you have the jumper cables, you're, no, stop playing with her knobs. Now, since you are in charge. Let's do some quickie deals before we move on to the big deal. I have five dollars. Five dollars for the first person to show me a pair of jumper cables. Pair of... Well, we have I won! I won! All right. Hi, right, what's your name? How much did I win? Five dollars. Oh, yeah! Five! I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll dance for you if you give me another 45. Mm. <laughs> Okay, I'll do it. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah, dance. Now I'll give you a beat. All right, Bob. Yeah. $50. Okay. I'll tell you my sister for another point. No, no, no. And I find that's because that, you know, it comes with years and years of experience. I feel very prepared. I'm very You look prepared. You're living Tens of cover, don't you, wouldn't you say so, Don? Well, uh, speaking in terms of preparation for the show, I think I've had years and years of, of pulling down a zipper, so. Sometimes, not very often, but sometimes I giggle. I take my job very seriously. Foreigners, they're the best contestants ever. They don't understand. They don't understand anything. We're going to have you stand right on the side. And what is your name? Aniceta Lecano. Yeah, okay. <laughs> what is your name? Ba Barsum. Meta. I'm sorry? Meta. Daniel. Bob Soon? Barso. Bob Soon? Barso. Bob Soon. All right. Meta. Daniel Tem Maldonado. Daniel Tem Maldonado. Donab. Daniel. Donab. Daniel. I don't get you, sir. I'm sorry? I don't get you what you say. And you say? Did I say that right? You speak English? Yeah. Okay, great. That'll be wonderful. Daniel Tem Maldonado. Donab. Daniel Tem Maldonado. Okay, just first name. Daniel. Daniel. And you say? My name is Anise Pelicano. Anise, okay, Anise, I'll try to remember that. Why don't you stand right over here, Anise, okay? And your name again was? Roger. Roger, okay. <laughs> Bob Soon, say hi to Doug. Doug, say hi to Bob Soon, okay. People love to be on TV. Right. I mean, I felt that way too. You know. yes. <laughs> we got a long way to go. <laughs> yeah, they do do silly things. Totally, um, this show. I'm, I'm, the deal I'm, I'm not me for a second. <laughs> I don't think it's greed. 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 There is danger to the show, and technically speaking, when we get down to the birthday deal. Susan's got a bat for you here, and you've got a hand in here somewhere. There you go. <laughs> and grab the bat, and I want you to take a swing at that pinata and bust it open! No. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Mark and Ty were right here. How you doing today? I'm doing just fine. I'm happy to be here. Okay, great. Well, <laughs> that's terrific, Mark. Well, we're going to celebrate your birthday today. Is that all right with you? It's more than just all right with me. Okay. <laughs> Boy, you're quite a talker, Mark. What do you think about that cake, Mark? It's, it's the best cake I've ever seen. <laughs> Somebody gave him a script, I think, or something. I don't know. Tell the boys back there to open curtain number two. Open curtain number two. Mark, is this the best birthday party ever? Yes, it was exquisite. Our... We'll be back to party some more right after this. And look at that. That's Aaron that popped out of that cake. Joey, will you tell the audience what you just told me when you saw that cake? Looks tasty. <laughs> That's right, and he's just a little boy. I've got a surprise for you, Joey, behind curtain number one. It's coming out. Whoa! And it is a belated birthday cake. We almost brought the house down with this one. 
Are you all right, David? <laughs> you know, I, there's times when I've sat backstage while the props guys are moving around, and they have a little area where they kind of sit and hang out, and um, they have some great magazines back there, guns and ammo. And I, I think we achieved it, don't you think? Did we have rehearsal for the show? We're rehearsing all of the time. Life is rehearsing. That's deep. Hang out to your seats, because Robert's going to belt this one out. Here we go. Do you want a beat? Yeah. All right, let's just clap. Don't worry. Be happy. What are you, what are you writing a letter there, Dave? Well, actually, I'm uh, kind of taking notation here. Notation? Well, good. You keep up on those notes. Okay. And we'll just get our tour going uh, <laughs> right along. Right along here. Lindy, wave hello to the people. That's right. If you think that looks good, you ought to see the rest of our... It looks terrible. No, I'm kidding. Lindy, you look great. Now, I want to introduce you to our cable puller. That's right. Here we go. Da, 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 da. And would you look at that? Oh, my goodness. Folks, it's Gizmo, the regurgitating cable puller. <laughs> Oh, enough of Gizmo. Right over here, sir. And I want you to grab right here and give it a good spin. Give him some help. Oh, Corinne's going to unlock the wheel. <laughs> give Corinne a big hand. Next, we're going to Lawrence, our race car driver. He just won the Cannon Cannon worth camera. <laughs> Cannon Cameron Cannon. Boy, I'm going to be on a bleeper, blooper reel sometime soon. All right. I am looking for somebody. David, we got a pizza. Huh? That's right. Susan just got the pizza. A pizza? Oh, it's it here. It finally came, so why don't Great. we take a look? Oh. And it is a Rebus Brothers well, Collectibles. I started it, though, because I got it started off wrong. Then I gave him the pizza. Well, that was certainly a nice gift. Now, oh my gosh, you heard Cheryl mutter backstage because it was so darn nice. Who else do we have here? We have a Hawaiian dick over here. Hi, how are you? Great, good. Oh. <laughs> Wait, Robert, come here. Come here. Just do it one more time for us, will you? Just do it one more time. Don't worry. Be happy. 